Have you ever questioned the reality of our existence? Is our world just a simulation created by an advanced civilization? In this video, we will explore the mind-boggling double-slit experiment and how it supports the belief that we live in a simulated world. Join me as we take a deep dive into one of the most perplexing experiments in modern physics. Thomas Young's experiment in 1801 paved the way for a groundbreaking discovery in science. While other scientists had studied the behavior of light before, Young was the first to conduct an experiment that revealed light's wave-like properties. When Young shined a light through two narrow slits in a screen, he expected to see two lines of light on the other side of the screen parallel to the slits. Instead, he observed an interference pattern of bright and dark lines, which could only be explained by the interference of waves. This discovery confirmed that light behaves as both A and A wave, opening up a whole new realm of scientific inquiry. Young's experiment also became a foundational principle for the field of quantum mechanics, leading to advancements in electronics, computing, and other areas that have transformed our world. In 1927, Davison and Germer conducted an experiment using the same double-slit setup, but with electrons instead of light. They found a similar interference pattern to that of the light experiment, which demonstrated that electrons also had wave-like properties, as predicted by Louis de Broglie. This experiment opened up new avenues for research in the field of quantum mechanics, which showed that particles could behave both as waves and as particles depending on how they were observed. The double-slit experiment is still considered one of the most influential experiments in the history of physics and has contributed greatly to our understanding of the behavior of matter and energy. In the field of physics, the double-slit experiment has always been a crucial piece of evidence in understanding the wave-particle duality of matter. In 1927, this experiment was performed again. However, rather than light, it was conducted with electrons. The result of this experiment was astonishing, as expected. The pattern observed in the experiment confirmed that electrons could also display wave-like properties, much like photons. This proved that the wave-particle duality of matter was a characteristic that applied to all particles, regardless of mass, size, or energy. The experiment paved the way for further research in quantum mechanics, leading to the discovery of other phenomena like quantum tunneling and entanglement. As strange as it might appear, the mere act of observing an experiment can interfere with the outcome. When the experiment was repeated with a detector to observe which slit each electron passed through, the interference pattern disappeared. This result is baffling experts and has become known as the observer effect. The act of changes the experiment's outcome. Although it may make sense that an external measurement can alter an outcome in the quantum world, it is baffling given the absence of external factors. This observation has far-reaching consequences for scientific research, requiring a careful balancing act between observing and measuring without disturbing the environment under investigation. Electrons, one of the fundamental particles of nature, have been studied for years by scientists. However, their behavior still manages to surprise physicists to this day. The observer effect, a theory that was formulated when scientists noticed the peculiar behavior of electrons during observation, highlights the strange behavior of electrons. Essentially, it suggests that the very act of observing the electrons and measuring their properties ultimately impacts their behavior. The theory challenges the traditional notion of physics, which suggests that particles' properties remain constant irrespective of being observed. The observer effect implies that particles exist in numerous states before observation, but collapse into a single state once observed. The concept has broad implications for our understanding of quantum mechanics, and its study may help us gain a better understanding of the way the universe operates at a fundamental level. As our understanding of the universe expands, the idea that we are living in a simulated reality gains more and more traction among scientists and philosophers. This idea suggests that our reality is not as concrete as we have always thought, and instead 
it might be a complex computer program designed by an advanced civilization. In fact, some researchers believe that the idea of living in a simulation can explain many of the universe's most enduring mysteries. The mind-bending experiment that is often cited as evidence of this theory involves a double-slit experiment, where the observed behavior of particles changes depending on whether or not the experimenter is watching. While this idea may seem far-fetched, it calls into question the very nature of existence and our place in the universe. Expanding on the double-slit experiment reveals an unsettling truth about the foundations of reality. As the experiment suggests, reality is not objective, and the mere act of observing events can impact the outcome. This brings up an important question, who or what is behind the simulation? Without delving into conspiracy theories or supernatural explanations, one possible answer might lie in the concept of consciousness. It could be that our collective consciousness is what shapes the world around us, and that reality as we know it is a co-creation between our individual and collective consciousness. This idea is not without scientific merit, as studies have shown that our thoughts and emotions can impact physical matter. While this theory has its limitations, it offers a more plausible explanation for the startling implications of the double-slit experiment. Ultimately, the question of who or what is behind the simulation may be the key to unlocking the mysteries of our existence. It's an intriguing thought. What if our reality is nothing but a simulation operated by a highly advanced civilization? If this is true, then everything we know and experience could be nothing but an illusion. But what is the purpose of this simulation? Is it merely for entertainment or is there some deeper meaning behind it? It's impossible to say for sure, but if we do eventually discover the truth, it could have far-reaching consequences. It could fundamentally change the way we view ourselves and our place in the universe. It could also lead to ethical and moral dilemmas, such as the responsibility that the creators of the simulation would have to their virtual subjects. The question remains, are we living in a simulation? And if so, what does that mean for us and our understanding of reality? The double-slit experiment is a fascinating phenomenon that has baffled scientists for decades. The experiment shows that particles can behave as both waves and particles, but only when they are not being observed. This suggests that reality is not fixed until it is observed, which is one of the key components of the simulation theory. In addition to the double-slit experiment, there are other pieces of evidence suggest we may be living in a simulated world, such as the discovery of digital bits in the fabric of space-time. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of our be able to answer the question of whether we are living in a simulation or not, until then, the simulation theory remains one of the most intriguing and controversial ideas in modern physics.